Idling will not warm up a car very fast. Driving is what warms a car faster. So does that mean I shouldn't be using remote start on my car? Ugh, there are so many winter driving tips we've all heard here in Michigan. What's fact and what's fiction? Let's start here. If you don't have enough fuel in your tank, it could freeze if the weathers get cold enough. Is that fact or fiction? I would think it's fact. Uh, true. No. Fiction. What can freeze is the air in the gas tank. That is why it's so important to keep your gas tank full when it is very, very cold out. All right, so fiction. But also a little bit of truth in there. Let's move on to... It's better for traction control if you add weight to the trunk of your car. Um, fact, okay. I guess. Fact or fiction? Fiction. That is fiction. Most cars today are front wheel drive. Putting extra weight in the trunk isn't gonna do you any good except cause more drag for the front wheels to pull the car. Well then, what about this one? Can cold air deflate your tires? Yes. Fact. Yeah. I think. <laughs> so I've seen it on TV before in Alaska when it was 120 below the tires all on this vehicle went flat. That is a fact. Tires will, will lose one to two pounds of pressure for every 10 degrees in reduction in temperature. Finally, what about that remote start? Is it really doing anything? If you have a remote start on your car, it does not warm the car up as much as if you were driving it around. Fact or fiction? Fact. Fiction. Do you think it helps? Yeah, it actually works. I speak from experience. It's probably fact. Yeah, I would like to say that. Actually. But not for you. The, the dude's wearing shorts. shorts yeah. yeah, so he doesn't need to warm his car up. <laughs> that is fact and fiction. It is fact because who on earth wants to get into a freezing cold car? And it's also fiction that you don't need to warm up the car for an extended length of time like you did when you used to have carbureted engines. But it's a very good idea to warm it up for a minute or two to make sure the oil starts circulating properly in the engine. You know what they say. The more you know. Derek Kevra, Fox 2 News.